Hi everyone, welcome to Imaging Study. Today we are going to see a case of midline prosthetic cyst. A 38-year-old male patient came for a routine abdominal ultrasound scan. Let's see what we have got on ultrasound. Here you can see the transverse section of the prostate. You can see this is the urinary bladder, this is the prostate. And at the central part of the prostate, you can see an anechoic cystic structure. This is a well-defined round anechoic cystic structure, which is located within the inner glands part of the prostate. There's the longitudinal section also. The surrounding parenchyma looks quite normal. Another magnified view, and you can see this anechoic cystic structure located at the midline within the inner glands. Sometimes you may see a dilated urethra. In that case, in longitudinal section, you will see the continuation with the urinary bladder. So here's the longitudinal section, and you can see there is no tubular tract towards the urinary bladder from this cystic lesion, and it still looks round. So this is a case of midline prosthetic cyst. Here's the picture. You can see the transverse and longitudinal sections. You can see the round and equic well-defined cystic structure located at the midline. It measures around 6 mm. As it's a tiny cystic structure, the acoustic enhancement you can see here may not be well appreciable like other large cystic lesions. So in summary, a midline well-defined round anechoic cystic area is noted within the prosthetic parenchyma, indicating a midline prosthetic cyst. Now the take-home message. We have two differential diagnoses when we talk about the midline prosthetic cyst. One is the prosthetic utricle cyst and another one is the Mullerian duct cyst. It's very difficult to differentiate one from other. The utricle cyst communicates with the urethra and may contain spermatozoa on aspiration. It is often detected in the first or second decades, whereas the Mullerian duct cysts usually occur in the third and fourth decades of life. Thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe our YouTube channel and visit imagingstudy.com for more cases. See you on the next one. Have a nice day.